Well, federal funding has played a critical role for a number of different programs in the city. Uh, a couple things that we've done, we have a, a, a incubator, an industrial incubator that has been in existence for almost 20 years. Uh, has spun off over 100 different companies, uh, small businesses that have now grown to medium-sized businesses and some very large businesses. Uh, most of that funding for that particular uh, incubator was done through the Community Development Block Grant Program. Uh, that has played a critical role in helping us to get capital into uh, neighborhoods and communities that really uh, we just don't have the resources or the ability to, to affect. And so that, that funding has played a critical role over the course of, of decades now. Um, for funding to be cut in that area, we have seen a significant hit. Uh, Allentown, uh, like uh, other cities across the, the country, has, you know, we, we lost almost 20 to 30 percent of our funding over the course of the last uh, two years. Uh, that is a significant impact for us. Uh, that's over, you know, several million dollars. Uh, money that we put into that incubator, that we put into Start Your Own Business programs, that we put into home renovation. Um, you know, everything from streetscaping to code enforcement to helping uh, to remediate blight in our, in, our, in our most troubled neighborhoods. All that's being impacted by these federal cuts. And so it is, it is so critical that folks begin to understand that, that a program that has worked for decade upon decade, uh, almost 30 years now, uh, that has made a difference in, in the lives of so many folks within our, our poorest communities in urban areas, not only in Allentown, but across the country. Uh, is, is really being impacted. It's sad because it's such a small part, <laughs> such an insignificant part of the overall uh, federal budget. Uh, yet that is the program that, that Congress has chosen to, for some reason uh, to go after. Uh, and it is the one program, quite honestly, that the federal government funds that has a direct impact on actually employing folks. I can't even begin to tell you the number of contractors that are employed uh, in the city of Allentown just by the money that we, we put out every year through things like, like I just said, curb cuts and facades and home improvement grants and loans. Um, a number of those small business owners are now affected because of, of the cuts that are happening on, on the federal side. Um, the, this incubator that I talked about, it, that money is no longer there to support that, that operation. So we're trying to figure out new ways uh, to look for, for those funds. But it, it is, you know, that one program has played such an important role in uh, helping to shape the city and helping to revitalize some of our poorest areas. And I'm sure you can find that from mayor upon mayor that you'll talk to that will say that this has really made a significant impact in their city. And to, for funding to be cut, you know, several years now in a row, uh, it is, it's, it's not just cutting money to cities, it's cutting money to people, uh, cutting money to jobs. Uh, and in, 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 in this time when the economy uh, and some of the folks in our most troubled neighborhoods are struggling even more uh, than, than, than folks uh, in, in other parts of the, of the country, that was their one lifeline. And so uh, it, is, it is, you know, I, I can't can't say enough about the fact that we need Congress to understand that what's happening here when they're cutting these programs, it's directly affecting people's lives.